Hey guys, it's Jay with Maverick Agriculture. Today I'm going to show you how to connect your RTK base station with your T40 drone. So first things first, you want to make sure you have your remote powered on, your drone powered on, and your RTK base station on. Okay, so to turn on your RTK base station, center button is power, soft press, hard press. When you use your RTK base station, you always want to make sure it's in mode 5. The mode switch is on the far right hand side and you can tell what mode it's in by the amount of time the light flashes. So right now we just have one flash. If you want to switch the modes, you hold the M button for two seconds and then that's going to turn yellow and now it's going to flash two times. So I'm going to do this three more times to get it to mode 5. Okay, now I have it in mode 5, broadcast mode. You can tell that by because there's five quick flashes underneath the mode button on the far right hand side. Now we're ready to link it to the drone. And then when your RTK base station is in mode five, which is broadcast mode, you go into your settings, go to RTK, select DRTK2 mobile station as your signal source, wait for it to say connected, and then when you go back to the home screen, you should see manual route RTK in the top left corner and you should see 28 RTK satellites. M number of satellites might vary, but I'm just seeing 28 right now. After your mobile base station is connected and you see the RTK icon in your top left-hand corner of the screen and you have RTK satellites on the top right-hand corner of your screen, you're ready to fly. And you need RTK when you do mapping with the T-40 or if you want sub-inch accuracy on spraying and spreading operations. All right, that is how you get your drone connected to your RTK base station out in the field. This has been Jay with Maverick Agriculture. Thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe.